The governor's attempt to take pressure off of superintendents running out of snow days is creating more confusion than help. Claiming to prioritize student safety and referring to a Buffalo area school district that had already closed, the governor announced, quoting now, my administration has been in contact with the New York State Education Department and it has confirmed that the day will not be held against, in this case, the Amherst School District or any other districts requiring waivers due to insufficient available school days. But as News Channel 9's Andrew Donovan discovered, his offer might contradict the law, or at the least, is misleading. The whipping winds made it an easy decision for the Central Square superintendent to cancel classes today. And he says in the hours since, the lake effect snow bans helped support that decision. That means Central Square has used six snow days, one beyond the allotted five. There it is. You don't see the house anymore. The view through Tom Calabufo's office window gives him a sense of relief that he made the right call. Oh, it was probably the worst ride in that I've ever had. He works on every snow day, but on this one, he's been trying to figure out what the governor's freebie snow day means. Nothing against the governor, but I think it can be misleading in the fact that I've already received numerous phone calls from parents and staff members. Many under the impression the governor is offering, in Central Square's case, a sixth day, implying the district won't have to make it up on March 18th, a previously scheduled vacation day. But the superintendent doesn't want his students getting excited yet as they wait for clarification. I think it's a little misleading because the way that I interpret it is that we would have to use all of our available days, which is April break, before we could even put in for a waiver like that. State education law reads that extra days will be forgiven only if the district has fully exhausted its remaining vacation days and that emergency declarations by the governor do not alone forgive districts. Even though the government made that statement, uh, and until the commissioner of education, who inevitably has the power to be able to do that, puts something out saying that we don't have to have 180 days in. More snow days will mean less spring break. In Central Square, Andrew Donovan, News Channel 9. And even though the snow day freebie was offered by the governor when asked for clarification, his office referred Andrew to the state education department. Its spokesperson says she's working on getting answers to Andrew's questions.